Hello, I'm Wooden Toby. It's time to round out engines 1 through 7 with my LEGO Henry the Green engine. Time has really flown since I designed Henry all the way back in May and June 2023, as I was finalizing my Gordon model. I had most of the parts by July, and filmed this video around New Year's. My Henry is 7 studs wide and 28 studs long. The cab roof adds an additional stud of overhang, and the tender measures 7 studs wide and 13 studs long. The model consists of just under 600 parts, including the green wheels from Big Ben Bricks. In the Railway series, following Henry's crash in the Flying Kipper, he was rebuilt into an LMS Black 5, a real class of locomotives. I designed my Henry after that new shape. Once I had built one big engine in Gordon, designing another, such as Henry, was relatively straightforward, and he shares many of Gordon's techniques. Henry's firebox uses an interesting internal structure to achieve a height half a plate taller than the boiler. For the tender, I originally went with a Fowler design like Gordon's, matching Henry's depiction in the later Railway Series books. Eventually, I tweaked it to resemble a Stanier tender, like the illustrations from earlier books and real-life Black Fives. Another new build is this utility van, based on real-life Diagram 960 parcels and miscellaneous vans from the Southern Railway, but with added bogies. I created a six studs wide design in my early days of designing Lego Thomas models back in December 2019. It held up quite well, and I upgraded the digital model to seven studs wide last June, making a few minor improvements. This type of van appeared in the model era of the TV series. Recolored in dark red, the Lego model could even serve as Percy's mail train. Although I don't believe these vans appeared in the Railway series books, Thanks to their grounding in a real-life British basis, they fit in well with my other rolling stock, and I was happy to finally complete an old design. The van is 25 studs long, and includes about 400 parts. Like my other bogey stock, it can be motorized with the LEGO Powered Up system, which allows me to run powered up goods trains for the first time. And that does it for today's new models, let's check them out in action, and then I'll catch you next time.